hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys an amazing treatment using only one ingredient this treatment is amazing for those that have sensitive scalp whenever they apply aloe vera to their scalp this treatment will help you to avoid hair breakage which in return will help length retention and grow a long hair if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel so if you're interested you know what to do grab a seat and let's get into it so the only ingredient you're going to need for today's treatment is okra so okra contain vitamin c a k calcium and potassium it also contain other amazing nutrients which are amazing for the health of your hair so what i love about okra is that it's a great source of moisture so okra will help to bring back moisture to a dry and a brutal hair it's also amazing for dry hair and dry scalp Okra has this slimy consistency, which you can use as a detangler. It's very similar consistency with aloe vera. So as I said before, if your scalp is sensitive to aloe vera, so whenever you apply aloe vera to your scalp and you notice it's itchy and you've soaked the aloe vera for an hour, you still notice that itchiness on your scalp. You definitely want to consider using okra in your hair care routine you can use okra to bring back your hair if you have a frizzy and dry hair so basically if aloe vera is not working for you you definitely want to incorporate okra in your hair care routine as this will help you to retain length and avoid any hair shedding whenever you are removing your protective style or whenever you are detangling your hair so basically what I did was I cut the okra into smaller pieces then I add water and the okra into the pot then I transfer the pot to the cooker. So the amount of okra you're going to use depends on how long and full your hair is okay so i'm going to go ahead and boil it for about five minutes so do not allow the okra to overcook because you don't want to destroy all the vitamins okay so i know some of you guys will be wondering why is she boiling the okra instead of just blending it straight away it's totally fine for you to boil it for about five minutes okay because you want the okra to release all the vitamins and the nutrients before blending it as long as you don't overcook the okra you're good to go okay so make sure you don't overcook it or you're going to destroy all the vitamins and the nutrients after five minutes this is how it looks like as I said before do not over boil it okay now I'm going to go ahead and transfer it to my blender so guys if you're those type that leave your protective style for a long period of time protective style such as box braid corn roll or any other protective style and once you remove the protective style your hair is frizzy is tangled up due to the fact that you've left the protective style for a very long time so this video is definitely for you so what i notice is that when people are removing the protective style they usually just go in and start to comb their hair without putting any form of detangler in their hair what you guys need to understand is that your hair is prone to breakage at this point so if you go ahead and comb it without applying any form of detangler such as aloe vera or okra you would definitely experience a lot of shedding and air breakage okra will help you to detangle your hair without losing a lot of hair very similar to aloe vera so this is alternative to aloe vera if aloe vera is not good for you you definitely need to try okra so basically i went ahead and strained the okra 
please do not skip this part it's very very important if you do you're going to have particles in your hair you can use anything you have to strain it out such as cheesecloth you can purchase this on amazon okay so basically you can use whatever that has a tiny holes to strain it out so this is how it looks like i love the color the color is everything as you guys can see it's very slimy very similar to aloe vera this is what you're going to be needing for your hair so i went ahead and transferred it to my applicator bottle for easy use now i'm going to show you guys how to apply it to your hair so this is what the hair looks like before applying the okra so now i'm going to go ahead and apply the okra to the entire hair this okra is amazing because it's a great source of moisture and it also acts as a detangler i love the fact that it detangles your hair immediately without any stress okay it also defines your curls as well so if you have curls pattern it will definitely define your curls as well so i just sectioned the hair i applied the okra to that section i use my fingers to finger detangle that section when it comes to detangling your hair this is the part where you lose a lot of hair okay detangling your hair is another ways in which you can literally damage your hair if it's not done correctly with this okra it's so easy to use and you will experience less shedding okra is also amazing at strengthening your hair and at shine to your hair as well it also reduces frizz as well so if your hair is frizzy you definitely need to incorporate okra in your hair care routine so as i said before if you're losing hair whenever you are trying to detangle your hair try using okra to detangle your hair don't forget to apply it to your edges as well your edges are prone to breakage so whenever you are applying treatment make sure to always apply it to your edges as well don't forget to apply your loc method guys so remember to always seal in moisture when using a water-based spray always apply your hair butter or your leave-in conditioner this also apply to whenever you are using oil as well oil and spray will not moisturize your hair if you don't apply your leave-in conditioner or your hair butter your hair is going to be dry okay spray and oil will not moisturize your hair if you don't apply your leave-in conditioner the benefit of spray and oil is that it helps to strengthen your hair it stop hair breakage and it retain length so always remember to apply your leave-in conditioner or your hair butter whenever you apply water-based spray and oil to your hair this is how the hair looks like once i'm done applying the okra to the entire hair i'm going to allow it to sit for 45 minutes before washing it out so i usually wash it out with a conditioner okay you can also use just water to wash it out it all depends on preference so guys we have come to the end of this video if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video thank you guys bye